Samantha Rose from the Jimmy Fund stopped by Weston Nurseries with a nice big check featuring the over $92,000 earned by Weston Nurseries towards the Jimmy Fund walk to benefit the Dana-Farber Cancer Institute. Well, today we're um, generating a little recognition for our Blooms, Brews and Barbecue event. Um, we're going to have our second annual Blooms, Brews and Barbecue on September 8th. Uh, right here where we're standing, this is a 10,000 acre, uh, we call it the Coliseum, <laughs> lawn area, park-like setting where we're going to have a band set up. Uh, four bands actually throughout the day. It goes from 11.30 to 7 on Saturday, September 8th. We'll have food trucks, including barbecue of course, but also sandwiches and snappy dogs will be here. And almonds ice cream from Westboro, nice. very popular uh, destination around here. They're going to be here as well. And then, of course, the craft breweries. We have a one-day liquor permit to serve beer and wine, and we're going to have uh, Jack's Abbey, we're going to have Start Line, and Marty's is bringing a bunch of craft brewers in from the area. Uh, Rachel from Marty's was really aggressive in reaching out, so she's participating as well. Last year we had about 900 people show up. We expect more than that as long as the weather's good. <laughs> and even if it's not come down, we'll have a 40 by 60 foot tent. Uh, you can watch the band, you can participate mm -hmm. with lawn games. Uh, kids are welcome. Lots of kids showed up last year, so it's ten dollars to purchase a ticket, and fifteen the day of. Food is sold and beer is sold by uh, food is sold a la carte up to the food trucks, and beer tickets are five dollars a piece, which is a good deal because yeah. it's really good beer. <laughs> um, and last year, like I said, we had nine hundred people, and we raised five thousand dollars for our Jimmy Fund Walk team, mm -hmm. and we expect to do better than that as long as the weather's good this year. <laughs> And can you talk about what the Jimmy Fun Walk is for those that don't know? Yeah, so the Boston Marathon Jimmy Fun Walk is taking place Sunday, September 23rd, and all the money raised goes to Dana Farber Cancer Institute, the research and patient care that happens there. And on walk day, you can choose from four different routes. So you can do the full 26.2 marathon route that starts in Hopkinton, you can do the half marathon route that starts in Wellesley, the 10K route that starts in Newton, and then we also have a 5K option that starts at Dana Farber, and it all ends at Copley in Boston. And there's food trucks, there's massage tents. So for those people that walk 26.2 miles, they can kind of unwind. And it's really just a time for people to kind of celebrate their accomplishments, celebrate their loved ones, and just come together at the end of the day of you know walking miles and miles to benefit Dana Farber. And I've walked it, my wife's walked it for I think 18 years and I've walked it 15 years, mm -hmm. the whole route, and we love it. It is so rewarding. One of the best parts is you talk to so many people mm -hmm. along the way, uh, not only with our own team, but other people who are walking for other teams and different causes. And you really don't have that kind of conversational time, many instances in life where no. you can talk to people for a two mile stretch <laughs> of the walk. And it's really interesting getting to know people that way too. Yeah, there's friends, families, um, different businesses and companies around Boston that all kind of get together for this one day. And this is making a big difference next to your Pan Mass Challenge. This is the biggest fundraiser for the Jimmy Fund. So yeah, this is the single largest um, walk in the nation. So we raised, um, last year we raised more than 8.7 million for Dana-Farber and um, we're just kind of hoping to exceed that again this year. Um, as a whole, we've raised more than 120 28 million for for Dana Farber since 1989. So anyway, that's what it's all about. Yeah. Thank you, Samantha. <laughs> and please join us on September 8th for our Blooms, Brews, and Barbecue second annual. We plan on doing it every year. Mm -hmm. Samantha will be here too, so yeah. you can learn more about the Jimmy Fund. But there's a lot of food, fun, and and beverages to go along with the day. So it was a blast last year, and I think we're going to get a lot more turnout this year. Yeah. Well, Peter, I understand you raised uh, just over 92000 What's your goal for this upcoming year? Well, here's our little check. <laughs> yeah, big check. <laughs> but yeah, we we will we raised 28000 just last year alone. So our goal is twenty-five, trying mm -hmm. to keep it modest this year. Uh, but if we can do twenty-eight again this yeah. year, that would be great. And get them to the over the $100,000 mark cumulatively. Yeah. That would be great. <laughs> yeah. Now, we really believe in this uh, this charitable organization. They just about 100% goes to... Yep. 86 the cents to the dollar. The families, 86 cents to the dollar, which is very high. Yeah, that's great. It's a very well run organization, so we're behind it 100%. That's terrific. All right, well, we look forward to the event on mm -hmm. September 8th. Thank you, Tom. Thanks.